Hello, this is Kirill from ForexMode.com and welcome to the 15th tutorial on algorithmic trading in MQL4 for complete beginners. And today is going to be a very exciting tutorial. We're actually going to send our very first order through an algorithmic trading system. Yep, that's exactly it. You heard it. We're sending our first order today. And um, let's jump straight into it. So in front of me, I have the uh, code which we created in our previous tutorial. I'm just going to go quickly and save it as tutorial 15. So we have a new file, save that, compile. As you can see, it's compiling, it works. Um, we already have all the necessary information in here. We're letting the trader input the take profit level, which is set at default 10 pips. A stop loss level also set at default 10 pips but because this is an external variable the trader can change it once he launches the script uh, the on start function creates two new variables take profit level and stop left the stop loss level these two variables are calculated using the bid price through the take profit uh, supplied by the trader and the stop loss supplied by the trader as you remember point is just an indicator or basically a uh, internal variable of the terminal which tells us that um, the basically the amount of decimal uh, uh, points of uh, the current symbol and um, finally uh, at the what we stopped on in the last tutorial was we just printed out onto the trader screen uh, the calculate levels well today we're going to take it one more step further and we're actually going to send an order and um, to send an order, we have to use a function. It's called order send function. Now, don't get too concerned about um, the word function right now. We're going to look at functions in the next tutorial. For now, let's just use it. And um, as I like to say, let's learn by doing. Let's actually send the order and see how it all works. And in the next tutorial, we'll actually um, understand in more depth what functions are and how how to use them properly so we're going to ch type in order send i hope you're following open a, a standard bracket and here um, we have a prompt so uh, in these brackets we're going to have uh, we're going to supply a list of parameters which is going to click f highlight order send and click f1 this brings up this mql4 reference here you will see the list of parameters we need to supply for this function and uh, it's a symbol name the command in our case we're going to send a buy order volume number of lots price at which price we want to buy or sell uh, slippage basically that's uh, by how much uh, the price can deviate uh, stop loss level take profit level and a comment if we want to and some other parameters which we're not going to worry about at this stage because we don't really need them they have default values once again we will study this in more detail in the next tutorial for now let's just um, write the function so once again um, we need to type in the symbol name for us it's going to be euro dollar command uh, we want to buy and the command for buy is op underscore buy as you can see the prompt came up comma volume we're going to buy one lot price at which price do we buy orders if you look back a couple of tutorials you'll you can recall that we buy order we buy um currencies at the ask price which is the dearer price slippage we're going to send it set at 10 pips uh stop loss we already have the calculated stop loss and here it's asking us not for this stop loss not for the um amount of pips but actually the stop loss level and which we have calculated here so i'll just copy that and put it in and take profit we've also calculated that put the take profit in anything else yes it's asking us for a comment and as a comment we will say my first order exclamation mark and uh, we're not going to put in any of these parameters because we don't actually need to alter them we'll just leave the defaults and um, semicolon at the end we'll compile this as you can see here it's returning a um, um, warning uh, that return value of this function should be checked we're not going to worry about that now we'll look at that in the next tutorial for now that's fine for us it's just a warning it's not an error so we've compiled that, that compiles, let's go to the terminal. 
Okay, so we're in the terminal, and um, before we do anything, oh, well, basically, of course, we have to open the chart. We'll open the Eurodollar chart, and I'll quickly uh, pretty this up uh, to get rid of the um, grid. Yep, uh, zoom in a little bit so we can see the action. And now, before we do anything, uh, we have to remember that uh, for our algorithmic trading systems to work in MetaTrader 4, they have to be switched on. So this button over here, you can see auto trading, it's got a red button right now. That means that all algorithmic trading systems are switched off. And even if you try to pull them onto the chart or launch them from, from the navigator, uh, they won't work, nothing will happen. Um, so now we're just going to press the button, it's turned green, that means all algorithmic trading systems are now allowed to trade. And um, yeah, now we're going to find our script, script tutorial 15. I'll just switch here to uh, the trade um, uh, view, and here you can see that my balance is $5,000. Of course, this is a demo account, and um, I don't have any open orders at the moment. Um, I have just one account history transaction, which is a deposit onto the uh, demo account. So back to the trade uh, view. Okay, now I'm going to pull this tutorial 15 uh, script onto the euro dollar chart. Uh, as you can see right away, we have these three tabs. The last one is inputs. In inputs, we can choose take profit and stop loss level. So we'll leave them at default for now. And uh, we'll click OK. As you can see, it's brought up the the alert statement and of course our orders have our order has opened um, so let's go here um, to the bottom we can see a euro dollar order has opened uh, the buy uh, it's a buy order uh, it's a total of one lot that has been bought the price is 13633 which was ask, ask price when the order was open stop loss levels 1.3621 which is the same as in our uh, message 1.3641 is a take profit, same as in our message, which means uh, everything's worked correctly. And we'll just uh, close this message for now and um, we'll open up, uh, we'll add a section called the comments section. And in the comments, uh, it's probably very small on your screen, but you can see here it says my first order exclamation mark. So basically, there you go. Congratulations, you've actually just opened your first order. And um, that's that's very big step, and uh, you should be proud of yourself that you've made it this far. And um, yeah, so uh, in the next tutorial, we're going to look at uh, how functions work and uh, have a play around. You can open as many orders as you want. You can change this to 20, 30, and it will open another order. And um, as you can see, now we have two orders. So basically, play around with that. Next, in the next tutorial, we'll uh, go in more depth uh, on functions. Um, hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Uh, don't forget to uh, look on forexboat.com where you can find the source code and uh, more comments and more free tutorials. And uh, until next time, happy coding.